Today we're going to be unboxing a brand new Jules Air Plus as well as the Air Plus bassinet, showing you what's inside the box and setting them up for first use. So, starting off with the stroller. First look is like this, packed in its travel bag. And let's see, kind of our instruction booklet. And the stroller all pre-packed. Looks like that's all that's in the box. Okay, opening the draw strap. There you have it. Seems to be pre-assembled for the most part, but there is some packaging. So we're going to remove it and then have a look. So it comes with the stroller entirely pre-assembled, travel bag, and instruction booklet. That's it. In order to set this up, there are two buttons here, a safety button and a main button. And you're going to press it on the safety button and pull in on that main button. So safety, main, flip it up, and it will lock upright, and you're already good to go. Okay, the bassinet. Let's see. The rest of the box is empty. Going to remove the packaging and have a look. With the bassinet, you get the bassinet pre-assembled, a handle for carrying the bassinet, and the instruction booklet. So let's have a look at how to set up your Air Plus in order to use the bassinet. To install the bassinet, we're going to first remove the canopy and the seat. So we're going to begin here with the canopy itself then. If you look here on the inside of the canopy hinges, you see that there's like a little button or a tag. You can press this in with your finger, or if that's tough, you can use something like a chopstick or something to help you out. And you're gonna press in on that button, and you're gonna pull up and pull out the uh, strut. You're gonna do the same on the other side. Pressing it in and pulling out that strut, just to detach it. Next, under the baseboard of the seat in the back, where this crossbar is, there are these plastic straps. And in the front of it is sort of like a tag. So you're gonna press that in, and then you can press in on the baseboard itself, like that, and it will detach. Then in the front, there's another crossbar, and there's another strap here, and this is just more of a regular buckle that you can detach. Then we're gonna do the other side. So back one first, and then the front buckle. Next, we're gonna half fold the stroller and then we're gonna pull the textiles out. And the textiles are attached inside troughs on the inside of the bars. So with this upper portion, uh, where the seat back and the canopy are, there is a wider section to the trough halfway up. It's right here. I'm gonna pull this up till you get to that wider section. And then you're just gonna pull out those textiles. There's like a, a plastic pin inside. And that allows you then to pull it out do the other side too and then it'll be easier to do them both simultaneously for the end part. So pull it up halfway, pull it out, and then we can sort of pull back up the stroller in order to get it completely detached. Then this lower section is also in a trough and the wider point is right about here on the inside. So we're just going to pull down the textiles until you can pull it out. And then you can pull that side out. We're going to do both simultaneously again because it's easier. Pull it down a bit and pull it till it comes to the out point. And then we can slide the whole thing off. Like that. Comes with all the baseboards and backboards attached. And you can snap back up your stroller. With the bassinet, first thing we're going to do is attach the handle. So it has these buttons here. They're going to connect right inside these little bits here. Put it on like that. You can pick it up by the handle. And it connects on these bars. There's like a little rectangular hole here, and that is where the buttons for the connecting point are going to go. So I'm just going to line this up like that, slide it into place. 
you'll hear a little bit of a click. You can push that down and pull up on your handle and it will make itself all upright and ready to go. Later on, if you want to detach the bassinet, there's a button here on the back. So you just pull it up like a little flap, lift it up by the handle and it pops off and it stays upright. And then you can just slide it back in, keeping it upright as you like and put it back in place. So in any case, that was our unboxing and assembly of the Jules Air Plus with a bassinet. We will be doing a full review of this model as well as several instruction videos. So if you're interested in those, just stay tuned on our channel. In addition, if you're currently shopping for a stroller, we have a buyer's guide on our Patreon page which lists a wide range of models that we recommend, with a lot of technical and lifestyle related information. You can find it by following its separate link in the description as well.